Hello, and welcome to the cove with more vampire survivors. Alright, so we're going to go with the plan that we came up with at the end of the last episode, and we're going to see if we can find this secret, which is just down here, with the most adverse fate in Green Acres run off the edge of the world. Alright. So, to do that, uh, we are going to find a new character. Most adverse fate. I dare say that could be our, uh, this one here, judging by the uh, shadow. So let's unlock him. Red death. Yep, I think that could be what we're looking for. That is a uh, fate you're not exactly looking forward to. So therefore, I think that uh, fills the uh, criteria. All right, so uh, green acres. Right, actually, hang on a second. Did I see? No, nope, never mind. I thought I saw that we'd unlocked an extra stage. Uh, we had not. All right, Green Acres. Here we are. Uh, we'll take that, and for good measure, why not also go for some extra move speed? Yeah, we can do this. All right, and let's begin. Now we can get extra things for our little death sickle. Uh, hmm. It is a choice. What do we want? You know what? The Swash could actually be rather good. Although we could bring everything to us. Yeah, you know what? I think let's just go for the critical hits. Um, oh wait, that's not the one. Uh, there it is. Alright. Let's go. Now, come on. Yep, beginning... Well, he is, uh, fast. Ooh. All right, and you know what? As well, go with the, uh, the Bible for some kicks and giggles. And now, where are we going to need to head off? I'm thinking we might do uh, something similar as to the last one. So we might uh, head maybe up into the left or down into the right or something like that. And then, since we have the uh, evolutions, what do we want? You know what, let's go with the... Uh, what is it? You know what, I wonder if we can get two of these evolved weapons. That would be a fun idea. Let's go for the axe. Just go for something completely different. See if we can get two of the same evolved weapon. That would be very interesting if we could manage that. Alright, well, we're very fast. Uh, come on. Let's get a few levels at least. No, do they? No. Okay, so they don't die if we touch them. Uh, hmm. Alright, come on. A few more leveled up if you may. Oop. There we go. Put a bit more. Alright, sweet. And... We may as well go for... Spinach. Not really here or there. Not really going to be uh, in a tough way. Beginning with an evolved weapon from the beginning is kind of handy. And so since that's the case, we may as well go for the Bible. Get more of those things spinning around us. He is uh, super fast. Alright, uh, well we'll take the candelabra. Gotta be careful about running into characters this time. That's uh That's something I didn't expect uh, we'd have to deal with. Or at least not at uh, that rate of speed anyway. Right. Pretty easy, that's alright. We'll pick up all of this. And, uh, you know what? We have some spare places to do things, so, uh... You know what? Let's re-roll, see if we can get ourselves something else. Hmm. You know what? We could go for a lightning ringer as well. That sounds like a fun idea. So let's just grab the duplicator. Just run around, pick up some goods, and 
What do we need? Yeah, might as well just go for area. It's not really important at this point. Um, and we're certainly not really uh, pressed for being able to deal with the enemies, so let's just take what we can. And we'll, you know what, let's go for something else. Um, you know, should we go for the laurel and the... We could go for the ring. Um, sorry, going, go for the infinite corridor. Yeah, okay, so that sounds like a good idea. Uh, let's go for what will give us some um, health regeneration. Probably the regular whip, the lightning, and then we take the lancet as well. Yep, you know what, I think that is a... The call we'll make, so let's just stick with this. And, uh, see how fast we can level up. Alright. And, speaking of which, we do have a little bit of, uh, free space, so let's pick up the crown. Alright, see how well we can do with our little, uh, head guy. Uh, King Bible again. Make sure we're doing plenty of, uh, damage to all the little guys floating around. Make the most of our weapons now. Right, uh, what do we need? Lightning ring, the lancet, and the whip. Alright, so let's reroll. And, alright, fine. We'll just take the the area. That won't hurt us. But we don't want to waste too many of those rerolls. Alright. Come on. Alright, more Bible? And there's the Spellbinder, we will take that. And what else can we get? No. Let's eat a chicken. Yep, chickens are good. And we'll just keep going with what we got. We are sitting in a very comfortable position being able to feed all of these. Let's just uh, get a couple more. Yeah, we'll go for the crown. Actually, we probably should have taken the hollow heart. Ah, well. I'm sure it won't be the final opportunity. Let's go for the axe. Ah, uh, on. Catch up to all of our uh, left behind experience. And we'll go for the Bible. And you know what? We should probably take the chest as well. That'll do. Just, uh, maybe we should have uh, gone for a little bit of curse. Mm, not a bad idea. That being said, though, we probably don't need to give him too much of a buff. Um, oh, and there's the whip. Might as well pick that up. Probably with plenty behind. Alright, we'll take that one. And we will take this one. And we will get that. Alright. Let's see, what else do we need to collect? It was just the lightning ring and the lancet. So since we have the lightning ring pairing and the lancet, we can take what Oh no, we want the Black Heart. That's what we need. So we can get our uh, evolution with the whip. Just guarantee that we have a good amount of health regen. Right. Let's go. And we'll take the spinach. Come on. There are more enemies when you want them. Uh, kind of do whoopy loops going around. Spread out all the love. Right. Keep going, keep going. But look, enemies that don't have to worry us. You don't have to deal with the, uh... Yeah, those... Poor little plants don't really mean anything. Yeah, there we are. Let's go straight on through them. Oh. 
All right, there should be. Nope. Okay. I was thinking we might get an evolution, but then I realized we're only five minutes in, and the game doesn't really like doing that for us. It's all right. Run around, collect the goodies. Whoops. Ah well. It is what it is. Uh, hmm. Uh, we'll, we might as well go for the crown. All these uh, experience points out. Oh, there we are. Probably left plenty around. And there is the axe. Now we can see if we can get two death spirals. That would be incredible if we could make that happen. Does the game allow it? Oops. Alright. Well. Let's cook the plant people. There we go. The good thing is, having a character who's so speedy, it means we can just really cover a lot of, uh, the map without really having to worry about anything. Uh, yeah, we'll go whip again. And you know what, since we may as well uh, take it, let's just let's just head straight down towards the, um, what do we call it? The Golden Ring. That's what it is. And then hopefully along the way we will pick up what we need. Alright. So far it's not too bad. Ridiculously overpowered character though, I feel like this amount of speed uh, it's kind of a little bit crazy. Right. No, that's okay. Go in. Anyone else? Oh, it's a jellyfish. No. Not really a concern. Yeah. Look at that. Just going through them so easily. Alright. What else have we got? Uh, anyone big and scary? Not particularly. Alright, let's go for the crown. Again, if we can get the uh, crown maxed out, an extra 40% buff to every crystal we pick up is a very nice, a very nice addition. Ooh. Hey, there we go. Alright, so that's Unholy Vespers. We also get another level of duplicator for more projectiles. And our crown is now maxed out. Alright. That's not bad at all. And there is the hollow heart. Alright. Let's go bring on some more curse. Oop, there was a uh yep. And there's the lightning ring. Well. Oh. Isn't this just pleasant? And we may as well go for more spinach. Alright. Let's go on down. I don't feel like this is going to take us very long at all. Oh yeah. Now we probably want to get the whip going, just in case. We don't want to, uh, foolishly die now, do we? It'd be, uh, quite embarrassing for death to die. So, let's go for more base area. Let's make sure we've got a really good damage output. Uh, hmm. That skull is not really an issue. Let's go for more whip. So I'll take this. Oh, that's nice. Another three. Alright, well, we can deal with the lightning ring. Always nice. Um, hmm. Yeah, it does need to be a little bit. As long as we're not foolish with our health, we should be okay. There's the whip. Just hang out for a second, see if we can find a, uh, a razor or something. Oh, and there's a chicken. Now I dare say, like, I feel like uh, every time we've busted these open, we've almost always got chickens. Um, at least most of the times, anyway. There's the whip as well. Right, these little guys don't really have much on us, so let's, uh, high tail it down. To the ring. Oh, may as well take the truck. And the other truck. Alright. 
not too much of an issue. Actually, these guys are really easy. Let's uh, make sure we get this. Yeah. Alright. Four of them is good, actually. Give us a solid amount of experience boost. Alright. That's what we're talking about. You could almost say it is dead easy. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh, more lightning. More lightning. Uh... Throw a little bit more won't hurt. And we'll go lightning. Plant it. Lightning. Lightning. Alright, so we've already got that all out the way, which is nice. Alright. And get going with that. Alright, we're sitting in a very healthy position. We'll just deal with this Atlantean, make the most of our uh, running counterclockwise to our clockwise up Holy Vespers, so we we can hit uh, the Atlantean with as many of those projectiles as possible, as frequently as possible. And there's Lancet. Alright. Not doing too bad. Oh, that'll be nice. We just collected a... Uh, an attract orb, so I think we're going to get a fair bit of gold ring. So let's just quickly take everything else first. Uh, go with that. Go with that. Whoa. Alright. Oh, there's a uh, lion's head for that little staff fish thingy. We should get that because that should be an evolution. Oh. Hmm. Thunderbloom. Well, that'll do. Alright. Let's just... Oh, that wasn't a chicken. Alright, well, uh, let's uh, get going. Oh, fire sponges. Come on. Grab the fire sponge. Back away straight up north. Shouldn't take us too long to travel. Just gonna make sure we have a nice, easy path. Oh. And half out where we go. Too far. Alright. Straight north. And these guys are really an issue. Oh. Nope. Open for some chicken, but at the same time too, it doesn't really matter. Uh but we do want to make the most of our leveling up, which is why we're racing straight to the silver. Oh, track dog, you know what? We'll take that. And that should hopefully not catch us until... Where is it? How close are we? Oh dear, we have a uh, bit of a way to travel. Alright. Alright, let's just hang out for a second. going through these guys. Oh, gotta be careful not to run into the Atlantean. They are just a little bit beefy. And I guess we're gonna take it. Don't get much of a choice in the matter. Not that we really want to. Ooh, gotta be careful. Alright, there it is. Alright, now we can just kind of chill out for a little. And uh, take on some of these guys. Oh, did we already get the uh, bonuses from our tractor? Hmm. Okay, well that's not a good sign. I thought we had that running around with us. Alright, uh, let's take the silver rings. They are going to be crucial. Alright. More health regen is here. And more maximum health. Alright, a little bit of curse. Not at the end of the world. Alright. And that should be... Yep, there we are. Body tear. So now we are going to be doing health regen as well. Sweet. Alright. And a random azo. Hmm. Now what the healing could be nice. Uh... Damage reduction. Yeah, you know what? Uh, although the explosions. Ooh. Uh... Explosions. That would do one... 
two. That's not bad. Uh, hmm. But we could go for healing and armor and things. You know what? Let's just go with the... Let's just go with the healing. That's a nice addition. We don't really need much at this stage. We're just waiting upon our um, infinite corridor. Then we're going to uh, go for broke with the side of the map. Good thing is I feel like we're fast enough that it's not going to be an issue here or there. Oh, we we'll picked that up. Yep. All right. Now with the... Uh, Raise commence, you know, let's just go always. We don't really, uh, it's not that big of a deal. Oh. Alright, let's just, uh, keep on working them. Hmm. Come on. Just get rid of this ad plan here. The area for the Unholy Vespers is fairly large, so it's getting a little bit more difficult to keep them right on the edge. But you know what? We're at full health, so that's all that matters. Uh, hmm. Well... Come on. Go down, Silver Ring. Uh, not necessary. Alright, I'll just quickly run through there. We should have probably found a chest somewhere around here, have we, uh... Oh, there it is. Alright. Bring down. And you know what? Let's just pick up all of these. And let's go. Off to the left. The left side is the one with the positive one anyway, so... We can probably pick that up. A little bit of damage. Oh, okay. I thought we may have uh, just ran by something. Alright, uh, as I take the chicken. Alright, let's keep on going. Alright, let's just uh, chill out for a second. There is. The next one. Alright. Hmm. Alright, yeah, well, let's just go for the health regen. The health regen will do damage to enemies. And let's be honest, a little bit more regen never goes astray. Oh, we're gonna do some uh, nice money generation. Oh, flame and good time here. Let's roll. Alright. Probably not the strongest we've ever. Uh, strongest build we've ever made, but it's certainly not bad. All right. Hey, Medusa, you know what? We will hang around her for a second. Uh, try and get ourselves that, that chest that she's going to uh, give us. We want all the treasure and loot. Yeah, take that too. Come on. Really too worried. Alright, there it is. And this should give us infinite corridor. Oh yeah. Alright, so now that curse that we added is now working to our advantage. Which is really nice. Alright. Alright, let's just uh, work with this guy. Shouldn't take too long now that we have the infinite corridor. Hmm. Come on. There we are. Alright, now that we've knocked his socks off, let's keep going over. And we make it. And how far do we need to go? You know what? Uh, let's head to the... Hmm. we just got to head up now, don't we? Okay. You know what? That'll do. Are we on the other side? Yes, we are on the other side. Okay, so now it's just a matter of running up. Which uh, should be pretty easy. So I'm uh, wondering how many gems we've left behind for that track door. So that'd be nice. Alright. 
keep on going. Yeah, well, might as well take the money. No harm in that. Not leaving any other goodies behind. That's still being chased by gems. That's okay. Okay, onto the dragon trip. Whereabouts are we? Hmm. Right. A decent way up. Uh, shouldn't be too long. Not with the speed that we move. Alright. Okay, so we're almost off the grid. I assume that's what it means by map. Like, if you're not on any, uh, coordinates. Like, that's... I think that counts for the, uh, map. Alright, so now we're off in new and uncharted territories. The question is, what do we do and what do we find? Um, hmm. Probably, right. Let's see if there's maybe someone in here that we're meant to be killing. No? Hmm. How far do we need to travel? There's a big buff dude. Let's get rid of him. Uh, no. Okay, so... If we were going to collect an evolution, we would have got those axes evolved. And it turns out we cannot do that. So... We have learned something new. You cannot evolve two of the same kind of evolution separately. <laughs> the more you know... Actually, it would have been a rather hilarious. You could have gone for an entire build of just a single weapon, evolved multiple times. All right, now let's just uh, have a bit of a look. When we did this with the uh, with the dog on Ilmalise, we found there was the what's his name, um, Rumba Blanca, or I think that's his name, something like that. And there were chests and other things, so I wonder if we have picked like if he if something like that spawns or how far can we travel? Alright, you know what? Let's see if we can go so far up off to the northwest that we can't actually see the map. Um, if there's no way of seeing it, surely that that'll be a uh, enough of the requirements being filled. Alright, let's just slow down there. We want to keep on healing. Uh, come on. Hmm. Anything in there? Nope. Alright. Uh, hmm. I'm actually getting a little bit concerned. I think we might actually be in some trouble. Oh dear. Well, we're almost there. How far do we have to travel? Oh. Big bad, uh... Big bad man. Come on. Get out of the way, you undead wizard. Oh, you're overgrown undead wizard, I should say. Um, hmm. Interesting. Is he the secret? No. Right, let's, uh, go a little further up. Oh, we'll grab the attract orb. Alright, a little bit further north almost be there. Ah, uh, that was a good sign. Alright, well, we are truly in uh, no man's land. So... I don't know. Uh, hmm. Well... There's another bat. Level up for our whip, which is always good. Uh, hmm. I don't know what to do. We have another 10 minutes. Should we try. Oh, well, we'll take the Arcana first and foremost. Uh, explosions. Uh, more lightning strikes. 
Um, yeah, sure, we'll take the revives, I guess. At this point, it doesn't really matter. Uh, let's head over. Yeah, let's head over to the right side and see if there's something over there. Um, hmm. ah, okay. Um, ah, let's just hang out for a little bit. Regen some health. Yeah, I, uh... Have we done goofed? What is the objective? Do we need to just survive for a full run with him? I don't know. Um, hmm. Most peculiar. I feel like the, uh, secret idea was pretty easily, uh... Like, you know, it wasn't too complicated of a riddle. At least I don't feel it was. Mind you, we could have just taken the wrong spot now, couldn't we? through there. I don't know where to go. <sighs> Let's just, uh, make the most out of our healing. Uh, and we'll just advance with our lancet as we go. North, north, east, yep, there we go. I really don't know what to do. Yeah, we're getting the running of the bulls. Oh, the minotaurs. Wow, okay. They're uh, pretty gun ho. Uh, maybe he's the big bad? Uh, or maybe the minotaurs are just the thing that we got to deal with? Uh, uh, hmm. I feel like we're stuck in a conundrum. Um, I don't know if there is a right course back at this point. Alright, you know what, we might as well take the, uh, power leveling. Yeah, we're not really leaving much behind. Okay, fine. Let's just, uh, let's just run for it. Whatever comes our way, comes our way. And, uh, we'll use some of the revives, I guess. Don't have much of a choice. Although the revives will make us a little bit stronger. Okay. Now it's crazy mandacles. Come on. Out we go. You know what? I think we just try and dodge some. Uh, uh, take that chicken. It's a small buff. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Uh, so there's the death. More chicken, that's always good. And not having a, uh, what is it, a sixth evolved weapon kind of sucks. Um, maybe the Laurel would have been a good choice just to mitigate incoming damage. Because how much health are we on? We have, ooh, 1373. That is not insignificant. Um, hmm. Alright, well, let's uh, keep on going. And how far across have we got to go? We have a little way. Um. Yep, flame sponge. There we are, roast manticore. Sounds delicious. Alright, although we are slowly running away from the uh, chicken that we left behind. That's uh. That's always interesting. Alright, fine. Let's just, let's just deal with you, Mr. Big Crabby Bat. I don't want him popping back up on the screen all the time. It's kind of annoying. Come on, we can get you. Oh, oh. oh well, we got him pretty quick. And... Come on, go away, Mr. Crab. Hey, there we go. And we still have a little way to go. 
Right, well, at least we're now onto the West Tanky enemies, which is fine by me. We will make good progress running through. Hmm. Alright, now we're onto the Medusas. That's, uh... Not too good. They're fairly tacky, if I remember. Um, bag of money. Uh, hmm. All right. Well, we've almost made it. So maybe what we're looking for is hidden over here. So that's good we go. Hmm. Oh my god. Uh, let's just, uh... Oh, yeah, we'll take that. You know what, let's just, uh, wait for the chicken and the fire. Barbecued snake. I've been told it tastes alright. Never tried it. Well, not till now. Um, hmm. Yeah, alright. Almost there. How much for... Oh, we've already passed it. Wonderful. Uh, hmm. Right, well, we'll go for the same theory of see if it requires us being completely off map. Um, how far does that require us to have traveled? Almost this far. Right, a little bit more. Might as well take the truck. And right. Anything? Anyone? No? Hmm. That is a bit of a shame. I was kind of hoping to uh, find something. Uh, what do we do? Alright. Well, we're not going to have time to run to the bottom of the map. So I guess we're just going to stay here. Um, Alright. I reckon we have another look at the secret after this run. And we see if we cannot figure out who it is is supposed to be there. Um, because I feel like this is the most, you know, logical interpretation of uh, what it was asking. But at the same time, too, uh, sometimes games will actually be a little bit tricky. I don't want to make it too easy, so uh, I will. There's always room for us to be wrong. Um, hmm. Alright, well, let's just, uh... Uh-oh. Going on to the bigger bats. Never good. Alright, come on. Just need to hold out for another minute. That's all we're looking for. Oh, well, might as well take a gold fever to finish off the level. As a chicken. You know what? Take the time freeze. Enjoy it for what it's worth. Ooh, uh, now we're getting the dragon shrimp again. Okay. Uh, no, that was just a... I don't know what that was that we killed. We'll throw some. Oh, uh, well. Well. Hmm. Curious. Where did we go? Alright, so maybe maybe we need to try the bottom right or the bottom left. I guess we could come back and try that. Um, yeah, if you have any ideas um, or suggestions or a hint, feel free to leave that in the comments. Uh, it's always appreciated. Um, yeah, because sometimes things in this game just don't make a whole ton of sense, so... Hmm. Alright, five seconds left. Here we go. Two, one. And an insta-kill. Now, let's see if we can kill death as death. Oh, okay, so we have multiple, uh... Alright. Uh... We should have our, uh, lightning. Okay. One more. Um, I feel like our lightning should probably be taking care of this guy. Uh, and yet here we are. Um, 
Alright. No. No. Okay. I think we're just toast. Alright. Well, we'll call that. And, uh, hmm. Yeah, we did not get it. Alright, let's head back over to our secrets. And we want... With the most adverse fate in Green Acres, run off the edge of the world. Hmm. Most adverse fate. Most adverse fate. Well, I would have thought that that would have been death. Um. Maybe it could be this werewolf one. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Well, I will have a bit of a think about that between episodes. And uh, yeah, again, if you have any knowledge, feel free to uh, leave a hint in the comments below and we will come back with that next time or maybe the episodes after, depending on how we film this. But thank you again for tuning into the Leviathan Cove. This is the Leviathan signing out. <laughs>